Hello people and welcome to another vlog. In order not to discriminate against the cardinal points, today we are going to go down south and as you can see from the title of the video, we are going to the beautiful beach town of Setubal here in Portugal. Now, we are going to get there by train. It's going to take us around an hour from the uh, Roma Arreiro train station. And I have a full day organized, guys. All school, this is the list of the things I want to do. I think it's going to be a really, really busy day because I want to see the town center and I also want to go to the beach. So let's see how it goes. And I'm extremely, extremely happy, guys, because weather forecast foresees 34 degrees today and sun and yes let's have a look at the weather look guys not even a cloud in the sky i am a happy vlogger today let's go walking to the train station now Guys, number three to Setubal. Okay, guys, we are here in Lisbon. We are going to go on the other side of the river, and by train, we're going to go da 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 to Setubal. So guys, we are now walking from the train station and we're heading south again towards the coast basically and we're going to walk through Avenida, I think it's like Avenida 22nd of December basically I'm gonna put it down on the screen and we're gonna see some cool spots on the way and then we're heading to the beach I already found some signs guys, so we're going to go yeah, that way I found this really lovely park as you can see here so we're going to go and walk for it just because we're in nature and we're going to go again that way it's full of this kind of like really cool statues look at them another one here another one there and there okay guys more signs here and can you see the last one uh, Convento de Jesus, I think it said. The problem is this, look at this. Unfortunately, it's under renovation, so that's the one, right? But we cannot get close to it. It's really beautiful, but yep, we cannot go there. So we're going to go, guys, first to the left because I want to see a church, and then we're going to, to the right to see those things. Alright guys, two seconds later we are in the square and that's the church I was talking about. Well, so this square is lovely guys because there are all these bars around. It's lovely just to relax, get a coffee, have a breakfast. Okay guys, we keep walking now towards the west. We are in Avenida Luis Todi. We're going to go to the Fortaleza de São Felipe. On the way guys, we found Casa da Bahia. And basically it's like a tourist info center. The building looks cool, really nice blue. And look at that, <laughs> that's cool. So guys, I have already done my research, of course, because I don't want to come here without knowing anything. I would get lost and I wouldn't vlog really well. <laughs> That's my style. Anyway, um, bear with me. I know I've been talking a lot and, you know, we've been walking a lot. We've not seen anything like crazy yet, but just because it's my first time here. So I just need to find my bearings, but we're going to the fort now. So let's go. 
Okay, we have some really cool graffiti related to the sea guys. Of course, we are in a beach town. So there's a lot of references to the ocean and the sea. And a lot of restaurants where you can eat seafood, which I'm not going to do because I'm vegan. As well as guys, you should be able to see dolphins in Setubal. There are activities as well. That way guys, to the right. Some cool art as always we can find in Portugal. And here we begin the walk upwards guys towards the Fortaleza. Okay guys, that's the Fortaleza I can see. We're going there walking and I think, if I remember well, I checked online, it's gonna be a 20 or so minute walk. We're going to go upwards though, so it's gonna take some effort. Yeah, so in case you come here and you walk, get ready. Okay guys, so if we go that way, we go to the natural park of Arabida. We are not doing today guys, I don't think we have enough time because I want to go to the beach and um, to the island of Troy. So I think we're going this way now, up there, where the Fortaleza should be. And then yeah, let's continue the tour and hopefully we will have a really good, amazing view. After 10-15 minutes walking, we are at Forte de Chao Felipe. We can see already the walls. We're going to follow just the road, guys. Easy peasy. And we should get to the entrance. Here we are, guys. Time to get in. Right, I thought there was going to be some kind of ticket to pay, but there is no one at the entrance. I'm going to go up and, and see, but uh, I can read really the sky. So let's go and check. Oh, okay, guys, are you ready? Oh my goodness. Whoa. Wow, wow. Wow, look at that. Ooh, ooh. That's the island where we're going to go later, guys. And there is a lovely bar there as well. Such a lovely place. Let's go up. Guys, this is a 360 degree view. Are you ready? Portugal. Oh, this is Setibel from up high, Troy Island. Wow. But yeah, the train station is kind of like that way. That's the harbor where we are going to get the ferry to go to Troy Island. And I can see already there is a lovely beach there. Oh, look at the water and everything. Can't wait to go. Mm. You check it guys, wow! Right, so this is our surroundings guys. Let's go around and check a bit more. Nice! Troy Island again, the walls, the coast, some nature. Nice, look at this. A lot of views guys, sorry but like I can't help, it's too beautiful. I cannot go after this point guys, but I'm gonna enjoy this view for a few seconds.
Okay guys, now that we have seen this beautiful place, which by the way is free of charge, I actually took cash just in case, you know, they don't get payment by card. If you're in Setubal, come here. The view, as you, as you saw, it's beautiful, it's amazing. There is a lovely bar that way and you can relax and enjoy the beautiful view and the beautiful weather. So let's move on now, guys. Let's go down, guys. Wait a second, guys. I need to see these actually. Oh my god. Look at the ceiling. How beautiful. Look. Okay, going for real now, guys. I stopped like 20 minutes to take some pictures, but yeah, we're going now, we're going now. Okay, guys, if we go that way, we go to the beach, but we're going to go there to Troia. Oh well, you better run. The only thing guys is that now we are going to walk along the coast because we've been inwards for a little bit and I just want to see you know, all the boats and stuff. This is what I'm talking about following this path we're going to go that way guys. Look at all the colorful dolphins. Got the happy one. The music one and, and the others. <laughs> and there's more there. That's the biggest. Look at it. So this is the arbor as you can see guys. And to give you some perspective, we were up there before to the Fortaleza of Sao Felipe. So I'm trying the macro lens to take some picture guys, wasting my time here. <laughs> I'm actually having a lot of fun. Okay guys, there is nothing really to show you here. Uh, there were a lot of restaurants before, so I'm gonna keep walking until we reach the point. At least now we are in this lovely park along the coast. Now, if last time we had the view vlog, this is the view vlog, but mainly the walking vlog. I've been walking for like three hours straight. <laughs> At least we know the ferry departs from there. So we're going there now. So we are at the Arbor of Setubal. And there is where we're getting the ferry, guys. Okay guys, so we're now waiting to get on the ferry. I actually cannot use the Viva car for Lisbon. I have to buy the ticket, which is eight euros. Four euros to go, four euros to come back. So it's gonna take us around 30 minutes and the ferry is every 30 minutes. So we are getting on board in three, two, one, now. Guys, we're on board. I cannot wait to get to the island, lay down on the sand, tan a little bit, and chill out. Here we are. Let's go and check the place out. It's actually a bit weird, guys, because you know, as you can see, there are like houses and everything there it says this is, must be the residential area with hotels and um, houses to rent I guess but um, I don't know I feel like I am in a different place because it's an island but you know when you arrive you see the beach and all these buildings and now I feel like I don't even know where I am anyway let's go and get some food and then go to the beach on this line guys we have all the shops and then there's this kind of like lovely park there and that's where we came from I do feel like in a different place like <laughs> and I shouldn't be I mean I should feel at home like this is the Troy Island my name is Elena or Helen in English Helen of Troy duh 
Okay, whatever, let's keep moving, guys. Sorry. We are there, guys. We are there. Flamingo statue is a sign. I can see the water. Yes! Da -da 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 -da. I'm so happy. Oh my god, the sand is like white. Lovely view, lovely view. Let's find a spot now. the map guys right so we arrived you know there here and there's there is all the trail here and we're just gonna go around here to be honest to the beach and relax for a while so apparently there's also this trail right really nice actually and you can just kind of like walk down i guess find a, a spot to go to the beach Should turn here to the right and go explore there. By the way, guys, look at the houses there, the pools and stuff, really cool. So, this is the video we have, guys. Pretty amazing. I think right there would be nice close to the water and other things so this is the lovely view that we have guys uh dive in is mandatory now I'm sure i'll get burned somewhere but you know with this view i can't complain i think it's mandatory i get in it's 2 p.m it's really hot i'm surprised it's not windy at all which is really great so let's get and see if the water is cool or warm. I bet it's gonna be cold anyway, but fuck it. You know, guys, I actually went in up to my shoulders. I think I'm a pussy. <laughs> like the Atlantic. Ocean water is so cold, I'm not used to it, and it's like, I don't know, you know, I'm used to the Adriatic Sea. I went, I swam through the Pacific Ocean when I was in Mexico, but I'm not used to this type of cold. <laughs> anyway guys, I'm going to do something, and then I'm going to relax and enjoy this beautiful weather and that there. Okay guys, I went in again for a swim this time. Finally, it's lovely. Water really, really cold, but I feel like I'm really worn, so it's really great. I'm going to have a nap now because I'm tired. I actually slept a little bit on the train and I'm just gonna enjoy it now. And it's also weird because if I didn't get into the water, I wouldn't be able to sleep because it's really, really hot. So I'm gonna pass out guys for half an hour, so see you in a bit. Okay guys, we are on our way back now, the beach was lovely, I really like that, you know, even though there were a lot of people, it was really really quiet, it was really relaxing, I slept, I had my nap, which recharged me, and now we're going to get back to get on the ferry and go back to Setubal. So there's another beach there guys, which looks really really quiet, and Setubal on the other side. Pretty cool, huh? And that's the ferry. Okay, guys, so we are back in Setupal. I'm now on my way to get to the train station again. I'm going to head back to Lisbon 
and I hope you guys have enjoyed this video in Setubal, really, 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 really lovely place. And I hope to see you soon in the next video. As always, thank you for watching. Love you. Bye bye.